what's good queendom crew welcome back to the queendom my youtube channel it's your girl nini and today i have another bomb wig review for you guys but first before we get started i need you to do a couple of things for me as always if you have not joined this family i literally don't even know what you're waiting on all you have to do is smash that red subscribe button to join this amazing queendom and become an official part of our family so why don't you go ahead and make that happen so you don't miss out on anything else that we have in store also, I need you guys to make sure you follow me on all my social media sets so we can keep up and whatnot. It's at Queen of Mindset everywhere you go. Make sure you guys check out my new book. It's called The Wig Game. And if you love wigs as much as I do, you will love my book. And you'll also be inspired. So make sure you guys check that out. And last but not least, please go ahead and join our Facebook group, The Queen's Connection, so we can stay connected every single day. All right, let's go ahead and get started. So, child, when I tell you we got to talk about this unit, we got to talk about this unit. So, this is Bobby Boss Premium Synthetic Lace Front Wig MLF 316 Luana. And I really just don't know how to feel about this one. She's cute, but she's not what I expected. I have a lot of tea to give you guys in my final thoughts. So, I need you to make sure that you stay to the end of this video so you can hear every single thing before you buy it. All right, let's get started. Okay, queens, I am ready to give you my final thoughts on this wig. This is Luana, and I have it in the color one. So some things I want to just start this video off with, y'all. I really kind of feel like this unit looks so much different than it does on the model. So just to recap, this is what it looks like on the model, and this is what it looks like on me. I did have some of those longer pieces in the front, but they were kind of uneven looking on my head shape. I don't know if it's just me, but I decided to go ahead and cut those off and make it into just a messy bob with the same length all around because I felt like it looked strange to me so some things that I notice about this unit the unit does look a little bit thinner than it does on the model I thought it would be a lot thicker of a unit like a thick bob and it's really kind of thin it is big head friendly though um, you get adjustable straps and three cones which is great the parting is really nice I did add some concealer and foundation into my parting just to make it pop a little bit more and I did experience quite a bit of shedding, guys. Like, even when I was just taking it out of the package, I did have, like, some weird shedding going on all throughout the wig. It has calmed down since I cut those end pieces because that's mainly where it was shedding. But it did do a little bit of tangling as well. I didn't comb through or brush through this unit. I just finger combed with my hands. And the unit's curls kind of remind me of, like, a messy... Uh, see, even there, like... I don't know. So <laughs> the unit does remind me of like a messy curly bob. So kind of like an abstract look. So I do like it overall. It's just not what I was expecting. So you guys, let me know what you think. Do you think that it looks different than the stock card? How do y'all like this look on me? Would you ever try it? Go comment so we can talk. Share this video with anybody you think would really love this style. And make sure you subscribe before you leave. Love you guys so much. See you in the next video. Bye.